don't tell me not to live, just sit and putter. Life's candy and the sun's a ball of butter. Don't bring around a crowd to rain on my parade. Hope when you take that jump, you don't feel the fall. When the water rises, you will to Open the crowd screams out, you're screaming your name. Hope if everybody runs, you choose to stay. Hope that you fall. Hey, baby girl. Today was supposed to be graduation, and unfortunately, it's not the one that we are planning, but great things are on your horizon for sure. We are so proud of you, and you know, we say that all the time, but there's nothing in my head or heart that is worried about you or your future. You're gonna make everything you want to have happen, happen, because we did a great job. I mean, mostly me. Um, you have everything you already need. You're such a good-hearted person. You're loyal. You're smart. You're beautiful. You're athletic. You're musical. I mean, my you're goodness. A little gassy at times. But... That happens, but it runs in the family. Yeah. yeah. Um, and today, you know, was the graduation. Tomorrow was going to be the party with a lot of people here and wishing you everything for the future. The best wishes from them for what uh, you can accomplish and what you're going to do and to congratulate you in person, but... Um, That's not going to happen yeah. right now, but you've got a rain check and hopefully this will hold you over until we can get everybody who loves you together in in one room or one backyard or six feet apart in a, a large arena. Well, it can kind of happen a little bit. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so... Watch this. Enjoy this video and we love you and there's no words to describe how proud we are of you and monkey loves you too and he's here but dad wasn't able to set up the camera so yeah i'm not a professional at all i don't understand why all right okay love you you know what we love you whole, whole bunches. bunches happy graduation sid i know this is not the ideal way to be having a graduation but just know that I am proud of the way that you have handled the situation. You always chose to look on the positive side of things and got everybody else to look on the positive side of things versus focusing on the negative. And I am just so excited to see what you're gonna do in Grand Valley. I know you're gonna achieve amazing things and I can't wait to support you and come visit you. But yeah, I love you so much and I'm proud of you always. And happy graduation, we did it. Me, I just love you so much and I'm just so excited to see where life takes us and as I'm making this video I saw a frog and I think that's a sign that you're with me you're the frog oh wait oh never mind it's just a leaf but but I just want to say I'm so proud of you and we're gonna be roommates and we're gonna have so much fun together and yeah, I'm so happy that you DM me on Instagram because if you didn't, none of this would be happening and I love you so much. Happy graduation, Sid. Um, I'm sorry that it's not what you really wanted it to be. And I know that you of all people are probably taking it the hardest just because you love everybody and everything and um, you make the most of everything. So I know this is probably really hard for you, but I just wanted to let you know that I'm so proud of you and you're gonna do great things at Grand Valley and I cannot wait to watch you accomplish everything and turn into an amazing person more than you already are. And um, I think my favorite memory of us is definitely when we met in sixth grade at conference when we first started doing track together and you were a distance runner and you invited me to your birthday party. And now everybody that I met there, we're all friends now and I think that you are one of like the reasons that I enjoyed high school the most. So. Thank you, I love you, and happy graduation. 
Hi, Sydney. Congratulations on graduating. Um, I'm sitting in my car. That's where we have most of our pictures and videos. You know what goes down in the car. But I'm so proud of you and I cannot wait to see what you're gonna do in college and if you're gonna become a flight attendant. And um, thank you for being such a great friend, one of my best friends, um, a great teammate. And I'm so excited to see what you're gonna do. And I love you and I hope to see you soon. Bye. Congratulations, Sid. Um, although this isn't probably the ideal way that you pictured your high school graduation to be, I hope that all these videos that have been put together really make you feel special. Um, from the moment that we first spoke that one day at Hello Dolly rehearsal, like I knew we were gonna be like this and I was right. Um, you're the type of person that like we could go a few weeks without talking a few months and pick up right where we left off and I love that so much and I'm so happy that we've stayed so close. Um, and I'm so excited to see what this next chapter of your life at Grand Valley has in store for you. Um, literally like the best is yet to come and I just cannot wait for you to experience that. So just take this time to really focus on yourself and just go out there, be yourself, meet as many people as you can. Never say no to an opportunity that's presented to you. You never know who you're gonna meet. Like it, it's just, college is a great thing. I am so excited that you're finally at that chapter of your life. Um, you're gonna grow and thrive uh, academically, athletically, socially. And I'm just so excited to see everything that Grand Valley has in store for you. Love you so much. Hey Sid, happy graduation. I wish I could be there, but I'm so proud of you and I love you so much. And I can't wait to see all the great things you're gonna do in college. Have so much fun at Grand Valley. Your mom's going to Grand Valley. Hi Sid, I just wanted to say congratulations on graduating and committing to your dream school. I'm so excited to come watch you jump and visit you all the time. Thank you so much for being my best friend through all these years. I really couldn't have made it through high school without you. You're truly an amazing person and I cannot wait to see you accomplish in life. I love you. Hi Sydney, it's Coach Markwell. I wanted to congratulate you on your graduation. The four years that we've had together have gone really quickly and I enjoyed it very much. Hope you did also. I'm looking forward to hearing what happens in the future, both in and out of track. Stay in touch. Hello Sydney, congratulations on graduating. I'm super happy we were able to work together last year and that you ended up at Grand Valley State, which is one of my favorite schools and, and programs. You are definitely one of the nicest and most impressive student athletes that I've worked with over the last 10 years. I know things are a little bit crazy now, but once you step foot on Grand Valley State, you are going to love it there and you're gonna start a whole new chapter of your life. Best of luck with everything and I really hope to keep in touch with you. Hi Sydney, my name is Brody, I'm your brother, and I'm really sad I can't be there with you to celebrate your, your graduation, but I love you very much and Good luck in college, and I hope to see you soon. Congratulations. You're not <laughs> Hey, Sid. Congrats on graduating high school. I'm so proud of you. Even though you're the only one that's playing a sport in college, we both know who the better athlete is. I love you. 525,600 minutes. 525,000 moments, oh dear. 525,600 minutes How do you measure, measure a year In daylights, in sunsets Hi there! Congratulations, Sydney. What a wonderful day for you. I'm so excited for you. Um, just wanted to tell you from both Tom and I that we love you and we hope you have a really wonderful day. And even though you're not spending it with all of your friends, you're home with family and all of us are thinking of you on this day. You know, I have a lot of wonderful memories of you, of course, from the day you were born on that super hot June day to moving in from the small house to the big house, from all kinds of dance recitals, seeing you perform and just watching you grow up. And you are so beautiful. So. Please enjoy today. We love you and congratulations. Sydney! Oh. I was planning on coming out. I talked to uh, um, your mom's name. What's your mom's name? Uh, Lauren. Um, 
I was gonna come out and surprise you. I had it in my calendar. I already had everything planned and worked out, but um, not happening. So I'm sorry. Um, but Lauren and <clears throat> your father um, asked if a bunch of us would put a little video together and just talking about you and um, that's that's not hard to do. Um, one of my favorite videos of you is when you were you were like two or three, and you had a yeah you like that yeah me too. Uh, you had a uh, Blinky the Clown T-shirt on, and Calvin Scott is singing uh, the song. Um, I can't remember the name of it, but it was a song by by, by my buddy John Almet, and he's got a, a, a helmet, a, a football helmet. And he's playing with it, and he's singing the song. And you come into the picture, come in the picture like this. Hi, and you've got the t Blinky the Clown T-shirt on, and you're like, boop. And you trip over his feet and boop, and he just keeps on singing. I pick a flow away, but I can't sing yet. The whole spot that day, we still speak. I love you dearly, and um, I'm so proud of you. So, so proud of you. Um, and here's a small, I'm not gonna do the whole thing, but. Uh, How sweet it is to be the love by you. sweet it is to be loved by you. I love you, Sydney, and everybody loves you, and I'm just so proud of you that you're, you, you with, with the high jumping and the track and all that stuff with school, it's, it's going to be awesome. It's going to be awesome. You're such a good singer, and we'll get our guitar uh, lessons going down the road, because I know you've got a lot of stuff going on right now, but uh, I just want you to know that Uncle Scott loves you, and uh, I'll talk to you soon, okay. Happy graduation, Sydney. I'm so proud of you. This is such a big accomplishment, and you have so many fun years of college ahead of you. Um, if you don't want to do that, you can come live with me, and we can eat tacos and um, fart and cuddle, three things we're really good at. Um, but. You're just gonna have so much fun. And I know this is a little bit of a hiccup with um, not being able to actually graduate and finish high school, but you're gonna have a great time in college. It's gonna be amazing. I love you so much. Bye. Congratulations on your graduation from high school today, Sydney. I'm sorry that you have to have it this way instead of in person. I really wanted to attend your graduation. You've worked so hard for everything you've deserved and earned. So this is it. This is your big day. And I wish you the best of luck. And I'll see you soon because I live close. But I really, really, Sydney, you have done a marvelous job the last four years and you really deserve the best of everything. I love you, granddaughter. Hi, Sydney. I miss you guys so much. I know you're missing all the fun of this graduation not being there, the prom, your track, the concert and everything. And I was thinking about that this morning and I thought, and I've missed all these years of being able to be there with you because I would have if I could have. So I just wish you the best for the years to come, honey. I hope you really get to go away to college and not have to do it on the internet. And I'm just so proud of all your accomplishments. I love you very much, honey. Be a good girl and take care of yourself. Hi, Hi Sydney. Sydney. Congratulations. Lollipop. Lollipop. Yay. We love you so much. 
so much and we miss you all so, so much. We proud of you. you. Yeah, we're very proud of you. We hope that you have a good pseudo graduation. Um, and we wish we could see you soon. Yeah. Oh yeah, we got a little baby here. <laughs> Come visit us soon once you, we're allowed to go outside again. Yeah. Uh-huh, yeah, all that. We love you. Love you. Bye. Bye. Congratulations, Sydney! You did it! You finished senior year of high school. You graduated! It's crazy how fast it goes. Um, although this senior year has definitely not been anywhere near what you expected it to be, it does leave you with some pretty valuable life lessons. Um, the first being that don't take anything for granted because anything in this life can change in the blink of an eye. Right? You learn that. <laughs> Second, life is not fair. It definitely isn't and it hasn't been for you for sure. Third, your family and your health are what's really important in this life and we've all really learned that. Um, you are smart, kind, you're beautiful inside and out and I have no doubt that you are going to do some great things with your life. So, congratulations! And try not to focus on the disappointments of what could have and should have been and focus on all the amazing experiences that you are going to have. I'm so proud of you and I can't wait to watch you follow your dreams. Congratulations. Congratulations, Sydney, on your high school graduation. Uh, you know that uh, your mom and I run and walk at least once a week, sometimes more than that. And a lot of the times we are talking about our kids. And um, so even though I haven't been there at your track events and your choir concerts and your football games, I have heard about them all from your mom. <laughs> and uh, I know you know, she is super, super proud of you. But it's not just all the accomplishments, all the things you've done, the awards you've won. She talks a lot about the person you've become, your kindness, uh, the choices you've made, how you treat other people. She talks a lot about how capable and independent you are. She talks about your humor. She is going to miss you so much next year. And uh, I'm gonna wrap this up before I get emotional, but um, good luck at Grand Valley State. And I look forward to getting daily and uh, weekly updates of all the great stuff you're gonna do next year. Bye, congrats. Hello, Sydney, and happy graduation from Southampton. Your folks wanted to make this awesome video for you where everyone could share anecdotes about your childhood and growing up, which is going to be really hard for me because I abandoned you before you were born and moved to New York. But I did come back and visit on occasion. And on one of those occasions, we were playing hide and seek. It was you, Cal, and myself, and your mother came up later. And so to fake your mom out, I picked you up and I put you in a crib and I covered you in a blanket. Great hiding spot, right? Well, when she came up and started looking for you, I tipped her off and was like, because parents always say they don't know where you are, but they really know where you are. So anyway, your mother always thought you were a genius. So of course she sees you in the crib and she says to me, And I was like, so it's clear from the beginning, your folks thought so highly of you and knew that you could accomplish anything. And honestly, with their support, you really have. You couldn't have had two better parental units guiding you and showing you the way, which is why you turned out to be the lovely young woman that you are today. So on this happy occasion of your graduation, just know that you've got nowhere to go, from here, but up, baby girl. So, happy graduation from Southampton. Mm -hmm. Congratulations, Sydney. Eleanor, what do you want to say? Um, I miss you so much at college. Helen, uh, Isla? <laughs> Congratulations, Sydney. <laughs> Hi Sydney, we're just dropping in to say congratulations and best wishes. We're sorry your graduation from high school wasn't what you planned on it being, but you're a great kid, you're gonna go a lot of places and you're gonna see a lot of things and you're gonna conquer a lot of things. So keep your chin up and know that we love you. Love, Aunt Debbie and Paca. 
Hi, Sydney. It is obviously TT and Olivia wanting to say for our whole family, congratulations on graduating. We're so proud of you and we wish it wasn't this way, but even though it is, you're doing great. And I know only more amazing things are to come in your future. Olivia? I am so glad that we're both graduating and I can't wait to come visit you down in Michigan. Yay! I'm Happy not, 2020! I'm as excited about that, but it's great. <laughs> Love you guys. This is great. Happy graduation. See you soon. Stay safe. Ugh, stay safe. Stay <laughs> Chris, safe. Cut that out. <laughs> Hey, Sydney, congratulations on such a great high school career. I know you got great things ahead of you as well. Uh, I'm sure you're really looking forward to going off to college, and I do believe it's going to happen for you. Um, and uh, I think you'll do really well there. So go Lakers and jump high and do great things. Enjoy the next four years. It's a really special time of your life. And do you know which uncle this is? Hi, Sydney. We just want you to know how proud we are of you. We love you very much, and um, we're excited to see what the future has in store for you. Congratulations. Congratulations. Bye-bye. Hey, Sydney. Congratulations on your graduation. I know this spring things have not turned out the way that you wanted them to. There are huge obstacles that you have to overcome, but just like jumping that bar in track, you've cleared much higher hurdles this will prepare you for things that you're going to face in your lifetime and hopefully one day you'll be able to look back on all of this and see how you've handled it with grace. Uncle John, Jacob and I are very proud of you. Congratulations on all of your successes over the year. Love you sweetheart. Hi baby girl, I just want to say how proud I am of you and just whatever you're going to do, you're going to be wonderful because you have a beautiful spirit and you're going to do wonderful things in your life. Hey Sid, I'm sorry that your graduation is ending this way, but I want you to know that we are so incredibly proud of you. I have loved watching your high school journey um, and I just can't wait to see what college brings. I love you, honey. I love you, Sydney. Thank you for being the best dance partner ever. And I can't wait to see what you do in college. I love you so much. What do you say to Sid? Sid, some up, Sid. Yay! Woo! Congrats. Hey, Sid. Happy graduation. Woo, woo. So proud of you. Love you. It's been awesome to watch you grow up and watch you do so well on track. I'm getting emotional, but um, I love you. And I can't wait to see what you do at Grand Valley. And Kennedy, our little puppy, she's barking. She says congrats, too. All right. Love you. Congrats on graduation. Wonderful, wonderful. 3.75 years. Hi, Sydney. Aunt Kathy here to offer a huge congratulations on your graduation. You've reached a milestone in Congella heritage. You are the last grandchild from Patricia and Lewis. I celebrate you today for continuing the legacy of hard work and determination. I am sure your parents couldn't be prouder. You strive for excellence and you give it your best in whatever you do. As a, as a multi-talented student, I'm sure that your high school also benefited from your success. Well done. Now, as you continue on this journey, I pray that you will remember your roots. Work hard, give it your best, but above all, draw closest to the source of all goodness and the best of everything. Draw near to God and allow him to use your great gifts to bless those around you. Carpe diem. Hi, Sydney. Happy graduation, Sydney. Happy graduation. We're so sad that this is your senior year and it, it played out this way, but you're a rock star and a beast and I can't wait for you to go to college and kill it there. And congratulations. I love you. You're, See you soon. You're an all-star, Sydney. I hope this makes it a bit more special. We love you. Love you. Bye-bye. <laughs> Hi Sydney, congratulations on graduation. I know this may not have ended the way you wanted it to, but I hope that you make the best of this situation and know that you have another four years to create all new memories. College will be some of the best years of your life. I know they were for me. Um, so make sure you have the most fun, take advantage of everything that you can do, but stay sweet and true to who you are. And know I'm very, very proud of you and I love you. 
Hi, Sid. I just wanted to wish you a happy graduation and tell you congratulations. I know this time probably sucks and this isn't how you wanted to spend your graduation day, but just know that I'm so proud of you and my family is so proud of you and we're so excited for what lies ahead. Um, I know high school is probably some of the best four years, but I'm telling you college is even better. And I'm so excited for you to be a college athlete because it's seriously the best thing in the world. I can't wait to watch your journey and see everything else that you accomplish. And congratulations once again and love you. I hope you have the best day. Hi, Sydney. Hey, Sydney. Hey, we're just uh, congratulating you on a great high school career. Um, we're so happy for you going on to um, fulfill your dreams. We're proud of all your accomplishments. We're glad we got to watch them on Facebook. Um, so glad for technology, especially now. And uh, we just wish you the best and uh, good luck. Yeah, and remember, Sydney, you'll have a great story to tell your grandchildren when you uh, are an old lady. <laughs> See you right. later. Have fun. Bye. Bye. Congratulations. We're so proud of you, Sydney. Congratulations on your graduation, class of 2020, and best of luck. Um, Grand Valley State University. Love you, baby. Congratulations, Squiddy girl. I'm so proud of you. I'm also so sorry that you ended high school this way, but at the same time, I hope you look back at the four years that you had at North and not remember just this, but remember all the things that you've accomplished and how you blossomed to such an amazing young woman. Um, to be your sister through this whole time is insane and I love you so much and I am so looking forward to what the future has in store for you at Grand Valley. Um, love you. Hey Sydney, I just wanted to wish you an amazing congratulations for your graduation and many blessings um, for your future in college and the Carter Clan's excited for you and go you, congratulations. Hey Sydney, congratulations on your graduation. Hi Sydney. You have done such a great job during your four years in high school. We're really very proud of you. You've done great with your academics and your athletics and your acting and your singing. You have so many talents. Um, you just made the most of them. And it reminds me of a passage in scripture, Isaiah 26, 12. It says, Lord, all we have accomplished, you have done for us. So I would thank God for all the gifts he's given you and I hope that you continue to honor him in all you do this summer and into your college life. Sydney, hope you have a wonderful graduation. You know, it feels like it was only 50 years ago that I graduated. 51. Oops, in fact, it was 50 51. years ago. No, I'm, I'm gonna turn 69, here you go. 51. 51, wow, <laughs> see? How time flies. And what happens after Yeah, and years. what happens. Anyway, hope you have a wonderful graduation, Sydney. Even though it's not going to be like you want it to be, a big gathering, um, you're with us and we're with you in spirit and we wish you all the best. And have a great summer. Bye-bye. So, Sydney. This is, a, this is a graduation video for Sydney Kangila. Happy graduation, uh, puppy. Sorry that you... Oh, wait a minute. Okay, come on. Come on in. Oh, oh there we are. There we are. That was so much fun. We miss you, and you know what? Do fuck it. Fuck it. Happy, <laughs> happy, congratulations. Happy uh, graduation. Sorry that your everything was completely fucked up by this whole bunch of nonsense, and you got screwed out of a good prom. Uh, uh, a graduation, it just sucks. Okay, so let me your talk. dad told me that this he's gonna a... buy you a new car and that's gonna make up for everything. And so... we've already given you a dog. But our lovely little niece, we adore you. And I'm so sorry that you lost out on all these rites of passage, but your life will be grand. You are everything anybody could want in a young lady. Yep, 
and we love you to pieces. And when you guys come out, we have a little square that we have preserved out on the uh, property. And it is our fuck it spot. Give it it's, another fuck it. Fuck it. Um, and and we're Dana, Dana will not be allowed to play because he is a sore loser. And something about a Cadillac. Maybe your dad will get you a Cadillac. You know, it's kind of a good car. It's, yeah, it's a good car. Kind of a, it's kind so of a I nice think the Cadillac, get a CTS. So that's the one you want. It, gets, it goes about 212 miles an hour. So that's going to get you places real fast. So you won't be late anymore. But in all seriousness, congratulations, honey. You've, what a phenomenal accomplishment. And I think that you have, in as much as you won't get the celebration, but you do get the, 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 the knowledge of, of completing this, this task, getting it done, going, getting your high school and on to college. This is so wonderful. And, and your mom and dad couldn't, you couldn't ask for better parents. Um, your, I don't know about your two brothers that that's you just say a better dog. You got, you got a really good dog, but got a good dog. I don't know what's, and we didn't brothers. dress up for you. Yeah. I, I especially didn't. I still got my Alice's shirt on. But honey, um, we love you and congratulations. And is it her birthday? Is there a birthday too? Hang up. Sydney, Sydney, hang up. Hang up. Hang up. <laughs> Chris, hang up. Clap along if you feel like that's what you want. There aren't a lot of people behind us. Christ. <laughs> I thought you were taking it. I'm, we hope that this little video that we're going to play for you, that's not what I want to say. We hope that it hang is on. what you. Hang on, I'll start again. Cock a doodle doo to you. Hey, baby girl. Graduation from high school. It's supposed to happen today. And it didn't work out as we planned. And uh, we're sorry. But uh, things will be okay. Can you fucking jump in when you're supposed to? Oh my god, you are the silent person. You yap all your fucking life and then you don't say a goddamn word. I don't know when I'm supposed to talk. Hi, baby when, girl. When I, turn, when I turn to you, do you, can you not see this? Watch. Ready? Look at the camera. Look I just at the like camera. Blind look, look at the camera. Here you go. I'm gonna do this. Okay? Would that help you? Jesus Christ. Now we gotta hold the dog. Stop talking so I can begin, please. Jesus. <laughs> Don't say hey, baby girl. Can I say hey, baby girl? when I call her. Then shut up. I know, it's just it's funny to me now. <laughs> You're gonna start laughing, aren't you? No, go ahead. Hey, baby girl. Today was supposed to be graduation. And obviously it's not the one we planned. But it's gonna be a good day no matter what. And a great future. Um, <laughs> future. You know, we are going to have a party this weekend, and people are going to be around and say how many things they hi. they like to. Uh, why did you have to say hi? <laughs> had to. Was, you didn't have to say hi. You could just she plow was through. Bye. From high school, and it didn't work out the way we planned. <laughs> Fuck! If I turn to you, that means you speak. Jesus Christ! Have you watch any television? <laughs> Can you put all this in?